It's a beautiful morning here in Pembrokeshire and we are in the car and headed north to go visit Ian's cousin. And I'm hoping to get some good footage on her sheep farm. But before I do, I need to issue a stern reminder and warning that those Englishmen who want to make rude jokes about sheep, you know who you are. You need to remember that Magenta Auto Travels is a family-friendly channel, and so you need to make those comments elsewhere, because if they're made in the comments section of this video, I shall delete them. I wanted to film a few seconds of our journey, which has been very pretty, but <laughs> it's extremely hilly, and the farmland around here is beautiful, but you really can't see it because the hedgerows are so tall. I watch you as you drive. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile. Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on. I put my feet up. And we just sing along. And I can't help but feel it. Just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time Don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? Forever Forever Now we are arriving at the farm owned by Ian's cousin Claire. It's time to show you some adorable animals. This is the county where she lives, but I shan't pronounce it because as you've learned from last week's video about me learning how to pronounce Welsh, I'm rubbish at it. Okay, so what's this breed? Oh, the Valley um, Black Nose Sheep. Oh, so cute. <laughs> The sheep are waiting for Ian to pick some branches and leaves and come feed it to them. Here we go. Well, they like you now because you're going to give them leaves. Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> now, they're, now they're queuing up for Ian to give them leaves yeah, out of the tree. Mum's given up with the, her leaves. <laughs> oh, oh, there's a little bit of aggression here. No, this is um, Hope. She's the oldest one. And she's... Um, the one who will always uh, push the others off the food if, she, if they've given the chance. Mm. They've got little black spots on the back of their knees or legs or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> That's Karamak the Wessel. Oh. He won't grow very much taller than that, perhaps five so centimeters more. Mm-hmm. It's the world's really? smallest sheep. The world's smallest sheep. Yeah. Really? The largest the rams get to is about 32 centimetres in height. Well, they, they originated from a, a tiny little island in France. This is Claire's son, Joe, feeding the sheep. If you missed last week's video of Joe teaching me how to pronounce Welsh in 10 minutes, I strongly recommend you watch that video after this one. I'll link it at the end of this video and in the description.
And then who's this one? Her name was, was Skinny. She is not now Skinny because she's now Fatty number two. <laughs> fatty number one. The fatty number one is over there. But I took, it took forever to get her to put weight on. You need to feed, it, feed her sticky toffee pudding. That's what's working for me. Don't forget to boop the like button if you like cute animals. What's the rabbit's name? Uh, Michael. Michael. He's a cute rabbit. The breed is Californian rabbit. That's hilarious. Ian's trying to feed the rabbit, but I don't think he's interested. Tell well, him you're... He might not be able to see it because he, I think he has lost quite a lot of his eyesight. He's so. lost his, his eyesight and his smell. <laughs> oh, look how cute. <laughs> Okay. The farm has glamping accommodations if you fancy a stay in this beautiful part of Breton. Check out the description of this video to find out how to book a stay. And now for the 2022 farm update. It's lambing season, and this wee lamb was just born in April. She is the daughter of Anemone, one of the Valet Blacknose sheep. So cute, right? I hope you enjoyed this little farm visit. Please watch the funny video of me pronouncing Welsh next. Thanks for watching this video and do something good in the world today.